Well, hello, everybody, and welcome to another Talent to Learning Hot Take Review. Today's hot take is on the Docebo LMS solution. I just got off an hour-long business briefing and then an in-depth demo with Docebo, and I learned all kinds of things, and I'm going to share it with you. Docebo is now surpassing $130 million of annual reoccurring SaaS revenue. They have 3,600 clients, 30 million active learners in 42 languages, countless countries. That's all supported by 800 employees in a variety of global location. So Chabo has a 92% uh, customer retention rate and a very healthy uh, 9.2 on their net promoter score. Uh, and so a real good solution here that's being well received by the marketplace in terms of buyers voting with their dollars and then also staying uh, with Docebo over time. I've been following Docebo now for 10 years. They're a known quantity. They're a perennial winner in the Talented Learning Annual Awards process. Uh, I've always known them to be the innovation leader, of being the first to market. With most of the cool things in our industry over the last decade, from gamification, mobile, 702010, LXP, social, microlearning, hybrid, integrations, measurement, and, and more. It's in their DNA, I think, to be innovative and putting their money where their mouth is with a hefty 25% uh, allocation of their annual revenue back into research and development. This has really uh, resulted in them being first to market with a lot of innovations, but then being able to expand uh, those new features and functionalities and make them broader and deeper over time uh, has been their modus. Uh, recently, in the last few years, as they become a, a profitable and uh, cash uh, revenue uh, generating type organization, they've been purchasing complementary organizations to build out their solution. And that's part of their, their suite of products. Their uh, LMS solution and their, like many training organizations in general, has gone through some evolutions over the years. It went first from being a, a learning management system, you know, a tool primarily for administrators to manage training, to drive costs down and increase efficiency. But then uh, they migrated that solution uh, over the years to be very learner and learner experience focused uh, to do exactly that. Focus on the learner, their engagement, the, the adaptability, the personalization of that experience to bring content that is relevant based on role or actions that they're taking inside or out of the system. And now, as they've mastered that, uh, or continue to master that, everybody's trying to continue to master that, they've evolved now into a solution for business, a, a, brain, a, a business training solution. And what that means is that now it's designed to impact every area of the business in a measurable way. So it's not just a cost center. It's now about improving processes. It's now about making money. And so Docebo's claim to fame is that their LMS supports uh, really any uh, combination of extended enterprise audiences. So if your organization is large and you want to use the same learning solution to train employees, customers, partners, prospects, contractors, the Chebo is the, the right solution for that. Additionally, for any of those individual groups, customers or partners and so forth, because of the ability to separate uh, the application and manage groups differently, they're good to manage if you just have one of those audiences. And so that makes Doterebo a very versatile and dangerous solution, quite frankly, because they're good if you want to manage all your audiences or just one or any combination of that. Their suite of products is, is growing and interesting. So it's the LMS, which I've been talking about, but then they also have the complementary products. One of those complementary products is Shape, and Shape is their AI authoring tool that allows you to very quickly create everything you know, load in PowerPoints or PDFs or videos and, and turn it into a course. They're about ready to release their 2.0 version of that where it's getting smarter. They also have their impact tool, which uh, exactly that. It allows you to measure the impact of your training programs and get to that uh, ROI uh, that you're actually uh, delivering the organization. They have Connect, which is their Workato white label integration that allows them to have no code integrations with hundreds and hundreds of different applications, including the workflow in between there. They have a data tool that somehow prepackages all the data inside all the different aspects of the LMS and pumps that to a data lake in a 
pre-formatted way that really makes it easy for organizations to use their own data lakes and BI tools to do analyzation of training data with business data. They also have this product called Flow, which allows you to embed parts all or parts of uh, the learning management system into proprietary software applications, taking learning where it is. And then they also have really strong teams and Salesforce integrations where they're doing exactly that. They're embedding the learning right inside the workflow uh, of those applications. They've got a white label mobile application as well as a strong API uh, to support uh, headless applications. So as you can see, uh, they've they've got some pretty serious horsepower, and it results in some pretty serious clients. One of their clients is Zoom that has a mere 1 million uh, active learners on the application. Another one of their clients is AWS, Amazon Web Services, uh, where they're trying to push up to 10 million active learners here over a couple-year period. That kind of scale is, is almost unheard of, and it makes... Uh, Docebo a viable option to compete against the largest global uh, integrated audience uh, opportunities out there. Uh, typically, those type of opportunities reside with Cornerstone, Saba, uh, Sumtotal, and, and SAP Plateau. But Docebo is a viable and much more affordable alternative and much more modern uh, to many of those systems. So there you have it. There's the Docebo learning solution. And this is John Lay with another hot take. We hope to see you on the next. Well, thank you, everyone, for tuning in to another Talented Learning production. You can find more of our fiercely independent content on learning systems technology at talentedlearning.com. If you want to show your support, please like and share this video and enter a comment down below and like our YouTube channel. It would be greatly appreciated and very helpful for us to spread the word. And if you need some independent assistance or guidance in your upcoming learning management system or learning system selection project, Please navigate to talentedlearning.com where you can request a complimentary consultation call with me, John Lay, the lead analyst and founder of Talented Learning. Have a great day, everyone. We'll see you on the next.